to On Air with Cash. Our guest is a singer, dancer, model, and songwriter. She was the first artist signed to Disney Records as a child. She participated in season one of The X Factor. She's working on a new single with her band, The Woolly Bandits. You can currently watch her in the Lifetime movie, Psycho Storm Chaser. She next appears as Sandy in the upcoming feature film, Eileen Warnos, American Boogie Woman. Please welcome Krista Collins. Hey, Cash. Krista, what's up? <laughs> Well, first of all, I'm very flattered that you called me a model. I haven't modeled probably since I was a kid. <laughs> oh, you're but, always modeling and doing cool stuff you. for your band and in your you. movies. <laughs> it is so good to see you. I know the pandemic has closed down so many things. I feel like it was, um, you know, at least once a month, I'd get out to one of your shows. You'd be rocking up, tearing the stage apart. But you have been so busy. I know that you've worked on multiple productions and you have a Lifetime movie, Psycho Storm Chaser, and you are in the upcoming feature film, Eileen Warnos, American Boogie Woman. Yeah, I I actually feel very lucky that um, I've been kind of prolific through the, the pandemic and the lockdowns. Um, it kind of presented some great opportunities for me. Um, so I'm, I'm grateful for that. I'm excited about the, the projects coming out. Um, they're both looking great. And the, the cast and the crew was just amazing to work with. I had so much fun. I'm very proud of both projects and how they turned out and that I got to be a part of it. That day when I texted you about a uh, studio space, that was the day that I was interviewing Daniel Ferens, who's the director of American Boogie Woman. I was interviewing him for American Boogie Man, the Ted Bundy movie that came out. And then I'm looking at, and you're telling me, oh yeah, you know, I'm doing this, that. You're you're kind of being a little shy, a little humble, which is cool. <laughs> and then I'm like, wait, you're in his movie and you're in this Lifetime movie? I interviewed like three, <laughs> three other actors from that movie. And then there were all these Lifetime. I'm like, Krista, quit holding back. Let's get on here. We got to talk. It's a small world. <laughs> Yeah, first of all, it, it's so weird that you know Dan. I don't know. It, it's again. Well, I met him that day. The day, literally, I texted you out of the blue because we needed a studio space for this project. And then it was like, wait, what? Okay, this is, this is meant to be. <laughs> yeah, I love Dan. He, we had so much fun on this project, too. Like, we just kept making each other laugh <laughs> through all the craziness. So. <laughs> <laughs> I have it's it's in the interview I did. He actually calls you a scene stealer, and you and Rick Rock love the bandits. God, she's yeah, she's she's a she's a scene stealer. Shin and her husband, you know, they're they're that's they they can do everything. Um, those those woolly bandits, they can do it all. Absolutely. So it's funny. It's such a small world. <laughs> oh, nice. Well, well, technically it was Sandy Sossaman who stole the scene, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> But that was uh, fun that he gave me an opportunity to feature one of my characters. So. <laughs> Love it. I am stoked. I just watched Boogeyman the other day, and I'm so ready for American Boogie Woman in a few weeks, September 20th. I had a lot of fun working with Peyton, too, because, you know, we both come from Disney backgrounds. And so we got to commiserate a little bit on that. <laughs> I have to admit something. I am a sucker for Lifetime movies. I love Lifetime and Hallmark movies. And I understand that you are currently in Psycho Storm Chaser available on Lifetime On Demand now. Yes. Um, you know, I have to be honest. I did not know that Lifetime was such a huge platform for thrillers. I had assumed it was more of like Hallmark type movies, but it is like... The, the thriller movie uh, conjunction and people are like crazy about it. Um, in fact, I had somebody asking me like they wanted to know like where it was filmed and you know like all the locations. Like they're the fans of Lifetime thriller movies are like really into all of the minutia of it, and so that, that's a lot of fun. Um, but yes, it's available right now um, on demand. Psycho Storm Chaser. Go get it and let me know what you think. <laughs> I'm intrigued. They're addictive. They're fun. They're a guilty pleasure. So I can't wait to see you in Psycho Storm Chaser. I am actually, I'm so proud of this movie because we filmed this at like the height of the lockdown. And, you know, I, I've worked on a lot of film sets, but like COVID really added like a whole other layer of, you know, things that you had to think about. And, you know, COVID changed a lot of things, but man, this the cast and crew of that movie were amazing. It, it really felt like a family. Loved it. I learned so much on that set. Um, 
the director Buzz Wallach is like one of my favorite people and his wife is also starring in it, um, Mary O'Neill. Um, they're just amazing, wonderful people. Yeah, it was just an amazing collaborative experience of like, how do we, how do we get through this and make the best possible thing we can? And I, th I think we achieved it. <laughs> I think so. I can't wait to see it. I'm putting it on right when we're done with this interview. You. <laughs> So I understand that you are working on a Halloween single with your band, The Woolly Bandits? Yes, we have. Uh, it's a compilation for outro records and Woolly Bandits are going to put a single on that. Um, it's just going to be like all Halloween songs. They want to basically do for Halloween what Christmas has. So working on that right now <laughs> That's amazing. is this going to be an original song or is there going to be a halloween classic you're going to cover as well no it's, it, they're all original songs yeah and halloween is like one of my favorite times of the year no matter what i always uh, carve jack-o-lanterns i'm always singing the monster mash in the backyard i get decorated so uh yeah yeah it's it's not really like a, a once a year thing anymore like a lot of people live halloween out <laughs> year round that's what i love about la there's always a costume party and people always there's always a theme to things yeah i know chris i'm so proud of you i mean you and i go way back we collaborated on one of my first features uh jack and cocaine you also provided the soundtrack that same year appeared in hard to forget you by the woolly bandits we collaborated on our web series another blackout we've been on a roll i can't wait for you and i to go on to our next collaboration what's in the works for you Wow. Well, I have another movie starting um, next month. Willie Bandits are working on a new album that I'm hoping um, will be released at some point this year. That's in the works. We have SGV uh, Sound Studios in Alhambra is alive and well through the pandemic. We, ha we hold on white knuckling it and uh, so we have like lots of events going on there recording we're hoping that we can get back to doing uh live shows there again once things kind of calm down but we have our record swap and art shows like uh the last saturday of every month so um that's always fun and we'd like to do some more outdoor screening events there as well so Maybe oh, amazing. We'll get... No, Chris, that, we all need that now. And I've just started getting out to some events and premieres, seeing some screenings. I want to see you rock. And everybody out there, this girl rocks. I mean, when she puts on a show, <laughs> she's getting the party going. This girl is rock and roll. Krista, you're one of my dear friends. I love you, girl. I am so proud of you and all of the work that you got going on. Everyone, follow Krista Collins, follow her band, The Woolly Bandits, and get ready to see her as Sandy and Eileen Wartrose, American Boogie Woman. Krista, you rock, girl. <laughs> Thank you. You just infused me with so much energy. I appreciate you. <laughs> That's what you do. Rock on. And I'm going to see you live very soon. Okay. Let's do it. <laughs> Take care, Cash. You too. Thank you so much for rocking out with me and Krista Collins today. You are on air with Cash. <laughs>